Good afternoon, people. How are we doing? I hope your Sunday's going okay. I thought we'd do something a wee bit different today. So yesterday I was in Poundland in the UK, um, Scotland, I live in. Aberdeen, to be precise. Um, and I came across a few belters yesterday. So at the end of the video, I'm going to explain these. These were not yesterday, but I'll explain why they're relevant, okay? So let's just get into this. So first things first, we have got the BMW, which I had seen and I've not managed to get. There was two, you might think it's selfish, but most collectors, you know, buy... To want to open, want to keep. So, yeah. And I left a lot, believe me, I left a lot of stuff. But this is a beauty. Honestly. Stunning. I love it. So, yeah, I'm happy to open one of them and keep one. And um, I'll keep pushing positive to my straighten things up. So, yep, two seconds. Then we've got the Quattro. This, I think I've got already, but there was a few reasons why I bought this. Um, my dad had an Audi Quattro when we were little. My dad's passed away. Also, my dad's birthday's the 24th of May, so I'm really sentimental. Anything with a 6 on it, or a 27, or a 24, or a 29, all these little things that mean a lot to me, I pick them up. So yeah, really happy with this. Um, I think it's stunning, I really do. Next pile, we've got the Honda Civics. So the reason I've took the gold one out is to show you. So let's quickly show you that. Um, this is for a display. I'm working on it at the minute, so yeah, I don't do dioramas and stuff, but I've got an idea, and I don't want to spoil it until I do it, so I'll just wait and show you, but I needed this one loose, um, this was in the long card and the blister was cracked, so I decided to keep this one, so yeah, beautiful, um, really, really nice, I actually think the gold's nice on the white, well, I like the wheels better, but yeah, beautiful, um, so I'll we'll pick this up, so the card's gorgeous, you know what I mean, yeah, I love it, um, we will just quickly go through this. Absolutely stunning. I mean, it really is beautiful, isn't it? And you know it's going to be much the same as that, because it has the same casting. It's just different. So red interior with the black and gold, and then obviously white. I quite like the inside of that interior. It's beautiful. It kind of pops with the white. I don't know why. What's your favourite? Um, onwards we go. So we'll do this two at once. So this is yesterday's find. By the way, they, they, not the Matchbox Porsche. Um, and not the SpaceX Matchbox diecast. They were two pound each, two, two, and two. Everything else was one pound fifty. So that's what sixteen quid, sixteen pound fifty is it for eleven Hot Wheels? So shop about. Like when they first came out, you were getting scalped. Um, you know everything's dear online, but just have a wee look about. Half the thrill is in the hunt. Surely, I'm gonna split this video up. So yeah, we picked up this one yesterday. Um, really nice. I never realised till I got home. And I thought, hold on, I've got that. I thought, I know I've got that, so short card with a beautiful metallic green, and then we've got over here the long card, um, which I actually prefer this at the time, but I by far prefer the other one now, so I'll show you both together. Yeah, I just, I don't know why, I just really like the metallic green. It's the wheels again, look, I've picked the red and black over the gold ones, so it's just preference, isn't it? Um, I do think the gold ones would look cool in the green, but yeah, so they're cool as anything, so I'm going to fix them. I won't waste too much of your time. This is for the display. I need this for the colour chart. So that's getting open. Nothing special. Um, I've got about six of these now. So I'm going to pick the best one to open. Because um, I hate when you've got a paint defect. Let's see in the door. Same as the white one. God, it does my head in. But if you're opening them anyway, you can get a bit of, you know, like, um, you know, like nail polish remover or something. Or I don't know, a magic sponge or whatever you call it. But I, or sometimes it just picks off. Sometimes it's just luck. The Jag's beautiful. He's getting opened. That's why I wasn't too bothered about the corner. I've been afraid. Really nice. It'll fit the theme I'm looking for. And it's beautiful. Really is nice, isn't it? I'll show you this for the sake of showing you. Nothing fancy. Yes, it's got a metal base, but it's very plastic you're looking. But it'll serve a purpose. And plus, who doesn't like a Humvee? You know what I mean? They're brilliant. I mean, you used to see Hummers kicking about when I was a kid. I'd never seen anything like it apart from films, so love it. Next up, we'll go up to the Porsches, and tell me if you're more stupid than me. I never realised until a local page on um, Facebook, one of the Hot Wheels groups I'm in, showed that these were actually key rings. So see the back? It sounds so stupid, but if you don't know, you don't know. I just thought it was like a cool sort of quirky, see how it says experiment works? I just thought it was like a maybe, I don't know what I thought it was, like a mad casting or like a concept. But yeah, apparently it's a key ring. I could be wrong, tell me if I'm wrong. Look at that, pop it out, pop that right in your key, boom, unbelievable. Hopefully there's at least one person here I've taught that to, and hopefully there's not about another million people saying, you're in a date mate. Matchbox, I love the fact that Matchbox faces one way and Hot Wheels faces the other. That's how it's very easy to spot an error. 
Hot Wheels face that way. And then obviously Matchbox that way. Same company anyway, if you didn't know Hot Wheels have got Matchbox. Um, but yeah, I thought it was really nice. I love Porsches. And last but not least, my little boy Warren, he is 11. He is grew up in Minecraft basically. He loves it. Um, so I picked this up because just when I see it, it makes me think of him. It's not necessarily to give it to him. He's not a big car collector. But it kind of makes me think of him. So that's why I picked this up. Um, so obviously it marks the 15 year anniversary. And I'll show you what else I dug out today because I knew where they were off by heart. So we've got the same car. Uh, the same car again, Minecraft. Track stars, blah, 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 blah. Let's see if we can get a date for you. 2015 Mattel. So yeah, I've had this for quite a while. Um, I never necessarily got it then. Maybe I did, I don't know. I just pick up things because it's only a pound here, a pound fifty here. I never overthink it. I just sort of do it autopilot. And I don't even know what this is. My son could tell me straight away, but I wouldn't even know. Again, I picked it up. We creasing the card, sadly. Never really, really noticed that till the camera. Um, again, quite cute. And I just thought I'd pick them up, so I'll put them all together and show you before we go. I'm saying before we go, I'm not even showed you them quickly. So yeah, really happy to have these. And as I mentioned earlier on the video, these were two pound a hat. These are very weighty. Um, so yeah, you've got seven years, you've got the Matchbox, and you've got the SpaceX. So yeah, and don't think I'm being naive, thinking these will be worth money later on. I don't. But a lot of collectors put away something. It's just something we all do. Um, but I think it's lovely. I really do. It's something so different. Um, yeah, I like it a lot. So there was a, a few left and I picked up two. Um, as I said, I don't ever worry. Unless somebody's coming home with seven of the same cast and, and everybody else has been left out. So what, what have I done? I've got two of them and I've got two of them and that's it, you know. I uh, used to see many was left. So this was Poundland in the UK. Um, let me just do one more overhaul before I stop. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I just tried my best to get my way a little bit. So taking them and matching up that and showing this off because I just opened it before I started the video. So yeah, I'm always happy to go that extra mile for people. Thanks for watching, following, liking, commenting, reposting. I appreciate everyone is. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.